Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, it is time for your quick, late night, raw review. Starts off with Ryback cutting a good promo on top of the ambulance, like I said earlier tonight. I think Ryback rule when he did that promo. It was cool. Well done. In the first match, Jericho and Miz defeated Fandango and Barrett because Fandango was dancing on the outside. It was okay, kind of corny and cheap, but okay. Second match, Sheamus defeated Titus O'Neil. And it was a pretty good match, pretty decent match for those two. Better than I expected. Then Heyman announced Curtis Axel as his third uh, Paul Heyman guy or whatever. Um, Triple H comes out, challenges him for a match later on in the night. An okay segment. Uh, Curtis Axel, <laughs> pretty cheap a bit as the third Heyman guy. It felt a bit uneventful, but might turn out to be good, who knows. Third match, Biggie Langston defeated Alberto Del Rio. And this was surprising that Big E got the win. And it was a pretty good match too. Fourth match, AJ defeated Layla. And that shit was hot. Hot is what it was. Very hot. Fifth match, Cody Rhodes defeated Zack Ryder, a.k.a. the ultimate jobber. He doesn't have his spiked hair anymore, just looks like a total jobber. And right back comes up and beat the fucking shit out of him. Throws him out of the ring. <laughs> Zach falls right, right on his face or whatever. That was pretty cool there. Sixth match, The Shield defeated Team Hell No and Kofi Kingston. And this match was fucking epic. And it was long and... A great epic match on Raw. Seventh match, Orton defeated Jack Swagger. Match was good. You know, nothing bad about it. I was hoping to get an Orton punt, but sadly we didn't get it. In the main event, Triple H was fighting Curtis Axel. But then, I guess because of the sledgehammer shot to the face, Triple H was all fucked up, like... Near the end of the match on the game. In the game. Then he was falling on the ground and shit. And they just stopped the match, I guess, because he was too fucked up. So Triple H might be out of action after this. So I guess Curtis Axel wins by default. Or fuck no, but uh, the show was good. I enjoyed the show. Nothing bored me at all. I thought it was a pretty decent Raw. Pretty good Raw, actually. Fuck it. Show was good. Alright, until next time. Peace.